All builder elements are able to load dynamic content. But first, we need to select a content source to define fields available for mapping. It can be selected in the Advanced tab of an element under Dynamic Content. Let's choose Article as the content source. And now, once a content source is selected, its fields are available for mapping. Open the Content tab again. And now, each content field shows a dynamic button on the right. It opens a drop-down with a list of all available content fields. Select the content field to map it to the Elements field. For example, let's map the article's title to the title field. Let's also map the meta text, content, and the intro image of our article. Instead of the former field, the dynamic field is shown with its name and source. Click the Edit button to open the available field options. To remove the field mapping, click the Delete button. Now, the former field is shown again.